Pete Alonso is going to go down as the greatest home run derby slugger of all time. And Jessica Mendoza said it with us on TV this morning absolutely perfectly. He is so well suited for this event, not only because obviously he can slam the heck out of a baseball like almost no one else can, but did you see how he was eating it up last night? He loves it. He loves this competition. He loves the, the show of it. I love seeing that. I love seeing the joy. One of the things that we have missed and have lost and sometimes in sports to some degree is just the pure, unadulterated joy. And I thought it felt to me like Pete Alonso just took so much joy in that event last night. And it was a joyous event. And all the things that we've seen in sports, since sports have come back, I'm not sure I've seen anything where everyone just seemed to be having more fun than they were having last night. And that's all this is supposed to be. At the end of the day, winning the home run derby, look, there's a bunch of money in it for these guys now, but they all make a ton of money. They were out there having fun. No one was having more fun than Pete Alonso. He was spectacular. The Trey Mancini story is obviously a great story, and for him to get into the finals was fabulous. The showdown between Shohei Otani and Soto in the first round was worth the price of admission all by itself. All things considered, that was a spectacular night, I thought, for the home run derby in a week that baseball really needed it. Hem, let me bring in my vice president of baseball conversation, Hembo, who has made his return, and we'll make this straight talk brought to you by Straight Talk Wireless. What do you think of my assertion? When it's all said and done, we will say Pete Alonso is the greatest slugger in the history of the home run derby. It's going to be hard for me to go there because I, as a kid, remember watching Ken Griffey Jr. do this and win it three times, as you see on your screen if you're watching on ESPN+. Plus. And for me, for some reason, he was the player I always most look forward to watching hit home runs because of how beautiful his swing is. He did it with a, a grace and an elegance. P, P. Alonso, I mean, his nickname is the Polar Bear. He does it with brute force. So I suppose it's a style thing, but I think he has a pretty good chance to break Griffey's record. Well, here's the thing. Now the comparison you're making, and, and maybe it is an apt one, because what is the home run derby most similar to? I guess the slam dunk contest, right? These are these are the two most exciting, physically spectacular right. acts in their respective sports. And so Michael Jordan was sort of the Ken Griffey Jr. of the slam dunk contest. Mm. It was it was there was a sleekness, his leaping ability. There was a beauty to mm -hmm. what he did. But then Vince Carter showed up, and, and for my money, huh. Vince Carter had the single greatest dunk contest performance of all time. Mm -hmm. There's something to be said for brute force. <laughs> like, <laughs> let's, let's not underestimate the value of just being so freaking strong that it is that, like, like P watching Pete Alonzo hit a baseball is like watching Bryson DeChambeau hit a golf yeah, ball that's right. at this point, right? <laughs> I, I, I think he is going, because, because I think he loves it so much, and he's so young. How old is Alonzo? He's, he's a baby. Alonzo is going to be in this event for a long time. Like He's going so. to do this. I believe he's going to do it year after year after year. It is going to become the Pete Alonzo Invitational <laughs> as time goes on. That's what I think. He's 26 years old. He, he was a college player, which, you know, so he started. But his, still. Oh, sure. He has a chance to do this many more times because he gets it. He gets it this week. It's all about the fans. He he. He, he's a perfect example of a player for whom he gives to the fans and the fans give back to him. When he called that timeout yesterday yeah. and pumped up the crowd, it was like the best rock concert you've ever been to. That was the vibe in the stadium last night, and it was a sight to behold. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.